Welcome to the VR Broadcast Studio Simulator. Game Background The VR Broadcast Studio Simulator is a game designed for middle and high school students enrolled in an audiovisual or broadcast class. This game will teach skills and provide training to students on specific types of AV equipment by using virtual reality simulators. Your objectives KMS TV Studio, a well known school news production company, has invited you to participate in a live news show. Before you can be part of the production, you must complete mandatory training on all broadcast equipment. This will be achieved by going through six workstations, each containing a different VR simulator. The workstations are clearly marked throughout the studio, and you will choose your starting point. Workstations You will participate in the following Director, Graphics, Sound, Camera, news anchor, and teleprompter. We're live in three, two, one. Like many real news studios, there are deadlines and time frames that must be met in order for a live broadcast to be successful. You must complete the work on each simulator within a specified time, or you will fail that piece of equipment and will be required to start over. Points are awarded for the lowest times recorded for each simulator. Some simulators let you earn points based on the accuracy, not time, required to complete the task. Main Menu Select the workstation below and follow the directions for that simulator. Once you successfully complete it, go back to the main menu and make another selection. Continue through all workstations until you are done. Director Workstation This simulator will test your ability to work with different video inputs at the same time. Your goal is to drag and drop each video feed as soon as it appears on the screen onto the circular monitor before time runs out. Each video feed is labeled to help you keep track of it. When you are done, select the broadcast button to see how you did. Sound Workstation This simulator will test your ability to work with sound inputs by using a sound mixing board. This is just one of the audio components you will be trained on, as there is also a turntable that you can try your hand at. To begin, click the play button and then start adjusting the sliders and knobs. Your goal is to equalize the volume and blend all the audio inputs into one soundtrack that sounds good before time runs out. When you are done, hit the broadcast button to see how you did. This game also allows a player to work with sounds by using a turntable. This is achieved by the player selecting different audio samples that they would like to mix together. The goal here would be to equalize the volume and blend all audio files into one soundtrack before the time runs out. Again, you would hit the broadcast button to see how you did. Graphics Workstation This simulator will test your ability to work with graphics and select the proper input channel between two monitors. To begin, click the toggle switch on each monitor to turn the power on, click the play button, and then select the input channel on the right that you want to start with. Your goal is to match each input channel on monitor 1 with the corresponding image or video on monitor 2. Each time you have a match, hit the broadcast button to see if you're right. Work through all four channel inputs as fast as you can until you are done. Teleprompter Workstation This simulator will test your ability to type words from a new script into a teleprompter screen. Begin by clicking the right button to generate some text in the white text box. Next, click your cursor in the black text box below and begin typing the words exactly as they appear in the white text box using the on-screen keyboard. Your goal is to see how much you can write until time runs out. As soon as you complete all the writing, hit the broadcast button to check your results. News Anchor Workstation this simulator will test your ability to match your speech with the speed of words on the teleprompter. Begin by clicking the right button to generate some text in the white text box. Next, press the space bar on your keyboard to make the news anchor talk. Your goal is to make the anchor talk as each word is typed onto the teleprompter screen. You will receive points for accuracy based on how well you time the news anchor's mouth to the actual words on the screen. There is no time limit for this station. After you have gone through all the writing, hit the broadcast button to check your results. If there is enough time, you can try a more challenging word screen with a different anchor that displays text much faster. 
Broadcast Camera Workstation. This simulator will test your ability to use a broadcast video camera used to film news anchors. Begin by grabbing the lower corner of the viewfinder to move the camera around. A red ball will start to move across the screen and bounce randomly in the background. Your goal is to align the viewfinder of the camera on the moving ball and keep it fixed on that object for as long as possible. You will earn points by keeping the ball within the viewfinder over the time allotted for this simulator. When you are done, hit the broadcast button to check your results. This concludes your tour of the VR Broadcast Studio Simulator. I hope you've enjoyed it and I invite you to read the frequently asked questions that follow.